Okay, so three, two, one, go. Hello, viewers, and welcome back to Bendy and the Ink Machine. Last time we finished up chapter one, and it doesn't take as long as, like I said, and welcome to chapter two, the old song. So, now we have to figure out how to... Oh, hold on. Oh, uh, hold on. I don't know if the audio screwed up or something. I know that it was working, so maybe we just need to leave. Alright, so we still get our fancy axe. And it seems like this passageway is blocked, so there's no way of going back. So let's continue where we were. Let's cut through some more planks. And let's proceed to our second chapter area, so... Utilary shaft number nine. He will set us free. What are they referring to, anyway? How did this place get so big? Well, it's been like years since, so... Wouldn't be that surprised, so... An audio diary! He appears from the shadows to rain his sweet blessings upon me. The figure of ink that shines in the darkness. I see you, my savior. I pray. That was Sammy Lawrence. I said, can I get an amen? Yeah, there's someone named Sammy Lawrence down here. So, yeah. And apparently he started some kind of cult. Um, I think we're supposed to do something? I can't remember. So yeah, there's someone named Sammy Lawrence down here as well, and yeah, he's still around. Stupid cutout. I think we're supposed to do something first, but I don't think the game tells you to do it yet. Okay. Let's just proceed forward. Into this puddle. Hello? Excuse me, can, can you help me? Hello? It's time for bed. And I guess that's Sammy Lawrence. Where the hell did he go? Stupid sign. Oh, what's this? Looks like a switch or something? Okay. And yeah, there's a statue. Need to get power to this gate somehow. Should be a couple switches nearby. Then maybe I can open it. Okay, redirect power to the gate. And did I just chop you? Yeah, screw you. The other two are back here somewhere, and now we have to go through this ink puddle twice. And I bet Sammy Lawrence was the one messing around during the last chapter. And did I chop you? No, I'd screw you too. Okay, so that's two. And three. Raise the gate. Okay, there's some kind of paganism going on here. So let's head back to the gate and open the door.
let's chop our way through. We're in the musical. It's really dark in here. And we're now in the music department. So, another audio diary. So first, Joey installs this ink machine over our heads. And then it begins to leak. Three times last month, we couldn't even get out of our department because the ink had flooded the stairwell. Joey's solution? An ink pump to drain it periodically. Now I have this ugly pump switch right in my office. People in and out all day. Thanks, Joey. Just what I needed. More distractions. These stupid cartoon songs don't write themselves, you know? So there's an ink pump for this sector and it's in Sammy Lawrence's office so hopefully we don't need to looks like the stairwell's flooded if I'm gonna get out of here I'll need to find a way to drain it and we know where to do it uh, drain the stairwell locate the pump control and we know that now it's in Sammy Lawrence's office so we have to find that room and okay oh god what the frick? What kind of evil mad scientist would make these eldritch abominations? Oh, great. Now we're dealing with Satanism. Alright, time for your beatings. Frickin' ink abominations. You know what? Screw you two. Okay, so yeah, we basically screwed ourselves and we're doomed and keys. And we found a nice pole hole. Good music. Another audio drive. Every day the same strange thing happens. I'll be up here in my booth, the band will be swinging, and suddenly Sammy Lawrence just comes marching in and shuts the whole thing down. Tells us all to wait in the hall. And then I hear him. He starts up my projector and he dashes for the projection booth and downs the recording studio like the little devil himself was chasing behind. So that was Norman Polk saying something about S Sammy doing something in the down there in where the projector was. So we'll have to check that out later. So recording. We'll check there later. The infirmary. And there's a lot of ink, so we'll have to come back here once the ink has been drained. Pipe organ. Wait, do I hear somebody? Yeah. Let's stay away from the pipe organ. Get another room. More doodles. Here's Sammy Lawrence's room. Well, there's the pump switch, all right. But that's one hell of a leak blocking the door, though. If I could just stop that ink from flowing, maybe I can get in. We're gonna need some more help. So yeah, we can't even access uh, Sammy Lawrence's room at the moment, so let's play what this... Usually a audio diary always gives us a healthy can, so what do we need to... So I was going to get my dustpan from the hall closet the other day, and guess what? Wally 
lost his keys, and I think I'm specifically in a trash bin when we. And I another did. Another day, another dollar. And I did recall where the ball key, the billiards room was. I distinctly remember seeing keys in there, so we'll just have to head that back right here. There it is. Sammy, uh, Wally's keys, and and if he didn't find his keys, so uh, I guess something bad must have happened to Wally. I hope he's all right. So let's open the door, and another diary. Every artistic person needs a sanctuary. Joey Drew has his, and I've got mine. To enter, you need only know my favorite song. The violin shudders with a piercing voice. Violin. The bass fiddle bass. sings with deep articulation. The bass fiddle returns and violin. sings aloud. Violin, bass, the bass. violin again screams. Violin. Sing my song, and my sanctuary will open to so, you. Violin, bass, bass, violin. Okay, that shouldn't be hard to remember. So yeah, you have to remember that. Then head in here. I know there's something I've got to do in here, but I feel like I'm missing something. So, let's see. It was... So, where's the violin? Violin. Bass. Bass. Violin. Okay, so it's not opening up. Oh, the projector. So, Norman did say that Sammy went to his projector. So I guess that's how we start, start up. So turn on the projector. Then quickly head back. And play the instruments. So it was Violin, bass, bass, and violin. And there we go. Got access to Sammy's little sanctuary. And the passcode is always randomized. So just to let you know, it's always random. So it could be any of the musical instruments here. Just letting you guys know. And another audio diary. So who's this one's all about? It may only be my second month working for Joey Drew, but I can already tell I'm going to love it here. People really seem to enjoy my Alice Angel voice. Sammy says she may be as popular as Bendy someday. These past few weeks, I voiced everything from talking chairs to dancing chickens. But this is the first character I've really felt a connection with. So she's a part of me. Alice and I, we're going places. So Susie Campbell. And Alice is one of the cartoon characters. So there's Bendy, Boris the Wolf, and now Alice Angel. Hopefully we don't have to encounter her, but Susie Campbell seems to be super happy as a voice actor. Or paganism. Sing a happy song. Whistle something merry time. What for his kin? He's coming very soon. One down. Okay, that should stop the ink in Sammy Lawrence. Oh god. So I guess Sammy knows that we fiddled. And I guess that's Sammy Lawrence and he's Oh god! Get the frick! Get the frick out! Piss off! Bug off! Alter splooge! Yeah, I hope you're enjoying it, buddy! You deranged psycho! I have to chop through these stupid ink pots! Yeah, suck on that, you freak! Yeah! Yeah, suck on that. I'll chop you good. Psycho. 
Okay, so now we should head back to Sammy Lawrence's room. And the pressure's gone. Wait. Wait, am I, am I forgetting something? Oh, we have to come down here first. Die. Elder Splooge. And here's... Oh no, there's no valve. Where did it go? Oh, great. Uh, utility access. Oh, great. We have to go down here. Down here, we're all sinners. Great, we're in the sewers. Was that thing holding my valve? Uh, phrasing? Just try not to sound sexual, Henry. Kinda did sound a bit sexual for a minute there. And I don't like your face. So let's go kill this thing. Oh, another audio diary. I love the quiet. And that's hard to come by in these busy times. And yeah, sure, it, it may stink to high heaven down here, but it's just perfect for an old lyricist like me. Sammy's songs always got some bounce, but uh, if I didn't get away once in a while, they'd never have any words to go with them. So I'll keep my mind to singing and, uh, my nose closed. Jack Finn. So, I can only presume that the thing we're after is Jack Finn. That's what people theorized. Sing. And we can't get close to him because he'll just run off. So we have to lure him back here. Okay, he's... That's serious. So we need to lure him... Underneath the... Cargo. So he should be in place. So we have to crush him. Oh, freak. I guess I'm doing something wrong. Now he's in place. Let's crush him. Sorry, um, Jack. But we need this valve more than you do. Sorry I had to do that. Nice hat, though. Same here. Alright. Yeah, that's what I just said, so. Now that we got the valve, so let's head back. Sorry, Jack. We had to kill him. I love the quiet. So and Jack that's hard Fed. to by these busy times. And yeah, sure, it, it may stink to high heaven down here. So Jack Fenn is dead. So let's put this valve back where it's supposed to go. And this is the infirmary. So 
nothing. Okay, that should do it. Really big going on here. So now we can head back to Sammy's room. And the ink pressure's gone. Pump controls. And a radio for one of the fan-made songs. Got included. So take the stairs. So now all that ink from the stairs are gone. So now we can leave this suction. Go! Ow. There we go now, nice and tight. We wouldn't want our sheep roaming away now, would we? No, we wouldn't. I must admit, I am honored you came all the way down here to visit me. It almost makes what I'm about to do seem cruel. But the believers must honor their savior. I must have him notice me. Wait. You look familiar to me. That face. Not now, for our Lord is calling to us, my little sheep. The time of sacrifice is at hand. And then I will finally be freed from this prison. This inky, dark abyss I call a body. Shh. Quiet. Listen. I can hear him crawling above, crawling. Let us begin. The ritual must be completed. Soon he will hear me. He will set us free. Yeah, so the ink demon said, screw you, Sammy Lawrence. Eh, great, my axe broke. Great. And I guess the only way is to move forward. Oh, God! Bad idea! Yeah, no, I don't want the ink demon to kill me. Run, run, run. Run this way, the... Straight way is a trap. And uh, he's getting closer. Screw you. Screw you, Bendy! Ha! Oh, oh, what? Defeated by wood! Screw you, Bendy. So let's get the frick out of here. And, um. Hello? Someone there? I know you're in here. Come out and show yourself. 
play. What? Okay, Boris? what? Wait, yeah, that's Boris the Wolf. And it's the... S and apparently they can clone themselves. With that one Boris from the first chapter. Looks like he came from Inca, Inca Sacrifice, you know, taking out the heart. Part of the ritual. Seems a bit odd, but... Who you gonna blame? So yeah, that was chapter two. Like I said, it's not a very long game to get through, but I think that's all going to change in the third chapter. And people claim when this came out, it was very notorious for something. So yeah, chapter three, Rise and Fall. leave the safe house so we're gonna do that next time so we'll start on chapter three in the next episode so until then i all hope you basically you can get through like i said you can get through chapter two okay if you know what you're doing i know there's like small easter eggs and whatever to look but i don't know of any so yeah so until then i'm just playing through this normally so until then i hope you all enjoy the this chapter and I hope you I hope to see you all in chapter three so until then have a good day everybody and I'll see you on the next episode next time so until then have a good happy Halloween if you're watching this on Halloween so I hope you all had a good day and I'll see you on the next episode next time so until then have a great day and I all hope a great day and I'll see you on the next episode so until then bye for now